So, today we're gonna show you the three most important salsa moves you need to know in order to dance salsa. We start with the basic, alright? So if I place my one, my basic, I go forward my left, I do one, come back, three, and five, six, seven. That's the basic move. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. You can hold her like that. You can go also in the close position. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. Also what you can do, you can put your basic on spot, yeah? One, two, three, I really recommend to do that in order to learn salsa, okay? You do your basic on spot, one, two, three, pause, five, six, seven, and quick, quick, slow, and quick, quick, slow, and quick, quick, slow, and quick, quick, slow. How does it feel? It's like you're on a stepper, you know, like... That's the feeling I have when I do, yeah? So you put your weight on, on one, but not full, yeah? It's like, <clears throat> and then you go on a step up and press, and then on two, then you are with full weight on your left leg, okay? So basically, if we do shines or we, we dance for ourselves, Tassi is doing also her one in front, her left. But if we dance into a basic, then we, we switch means she switch and go uh, back with our first okay she was using her right and then one okay so this is the first move go forward and back and that's it but I love to do it actually more into a close position where we can do it on spot so I really recommend doing the basic on spot because while you're doing that you can turn as you have seen in the intro and it looks like you're doing something different. It looks like actually you know what you do, but you don't know what you do because you're still a beginner probably. Okay, so I recommend doing the basic on spot, close position. Yeah, if you know each other, then you can put also the hand on your chest and kiss the girl. Kiss the girl. Did you hear something? No, just kidding. So one, two, three, and five, six, seven. Bravo. Move number two I really, really recommend is the cross body lead. Cross body lead means actually you are changing the positions, okay? So I open up, means I go one, two, and three, and I go, and that's it. So basically we are just switching the sides, but it brings a lot of dynamic in. For the ladies, so she steps back for the crossbody, one, two, and three, until five, and on five, six, and seven, she's already on her other way. So let's do it one more time. So she goes, one, two, three, until five, everything is normal, and then six, seven, okay? Let's do it one more time. And one, two, three, and five, six, seven. So Tasia is turning to the left in order to make her six, seven, and on one, She's again into her basic step. So we guys, we step out of the side of, her, or of the line. So we go one, two, and three, okay? Give a complete free line. As she's going, I do place my five on the same spot, or even if I want to bring more flow, I cross back five, six, and seven, and then I'm here again into my one, okay? Guys, do me a favor, don't pull her here. So the only thing we have the connection here on the back, but actually the biggest intention for her to or to, to understand the crossbody is I'm going out of her way. It means for her, okay, she can cross. So, so we do one, two, and three, and five, six, and seven. That's it. So let's do it all together. So we do a basic first, five, six, seven, one, two, three, and let's go crossbody, one, Two and three and five, six, seven, and one, two and three, and we can repeat it all the time. One, two and three and five, six, seven. Okay, 
This is all about cross buttoning, which is really, really important in order to dance salsa. Step. Next move. Uh, right turn. So, how do we do the right turn? Right turn means it's the opposite of left, so we go this way. So, we are gonna demonstrate first with her together. Five, six, seven, and one, two, and three, and five. One more time, and one, two, and three, and five, six, seven. On one, two, three, you go one, two, and on three, we face the wall again. And on five, six, seven, it's our half basic, which is five, six, seven. So the only thing you need to do is to remind, okay, basic step, but we need to turn. So just remember, the wall is one to the wall, to the wall, to the wall, and then five, six, and seven. That's it. That's the, it's actually a half basic. So that is the right turn. All right. So now, how to implement that in our partner work? So we do one, two, and three, look, and five, six, and seven, okay? So the steps will have the same, just with different counting since we are doing that in partner work. So let's do it one more time. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. So make sure, guys, depends on the preparation you do, that on three, the hands are open. I always say, well, I'm a gentleman, of course, we open the cover, ladies. And then she can go. So that means if the hands are open, like high here, she knows, ah, I can turn myself. Okay? So don't turn and make the hands up on three. That would be too late. So she turns on five. Let's see. One, two, and three. And now she has time to turn. So I would raise our arms up on three. And on five, she can turn. Let's put all together. So basic. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. Cross body lead. Five, six, seven. Right turn. And basic. Five, six, seven. And cross body lead. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. As you turn her, it's easy. You just need to raise palm. It's palm to palm. So we don't need our thumb. <laughs> yeah, so you raise it up, look, one, two, and three, and now she can turn on five, six, and seven. And the same thing you could do also with the right, okay? So I love to lead also with my right to her left, so I do one, two, three, arms up, up, and then she can turn, okay? As long as the arms are up, she can turn, okay? So one more time with the right to her left, and one, two, three, and five, six, and seven. If you're interested to learn this move, because this is really, really smooth, I recommend to check the Magic 8, not Magic Mac, Magic 8. Um, there I've done a video just about the right turn with my right, all right? Let's do it all together now with the music. Musica. <coughs> Con la musica la casa. Si, muchacha. Pum, bacalao.
interested in learning more and dancing more safe on the dance floor in order to feel more confident, check out my link mysalsalon.com. I got also a free class. Um, so yeah, there it's not only about three moves, it's a lot of more to feel more confident as I said. And uh, that's it. Thank you for watching and uh, that's to feel inside. Yes, yeah, you want to say something? All night. All right. <laughs> Was it all night? Okay. So guys, welcome to my salsa home. Boring. Boring. Interest me. Today I'm gonna show you the three most important moves in salsa. Oh, what the fuck? And did you hit up again? Cut down. What's the only most? The only most. The most important. Yeah. So okay, come. Yeah. Three? The most three important things. Was doch gerade gesagt? Oh Gott. Daniel, if you would, uh, if I would ask you, what are the most? Daniel, if I would ask you, what are the most important? No. Oh, Daniel, if, you, if I would ask you, huh? if, if you ask yourself. Also. If I would ask myself. Daniel, if I would ask myself. Yeah? Yeah. Daniel, if I would ask myself. Yeah, Sonder? <laughs> Sonder? Egal, okay. Nee, sag mal, und Ja, sondern so wie ich gesagt habe, if I would ask myself. Daniel. Ah. If I would ask myself. Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, if I would ask myself, what are the most. No, uh, ich finde es cool, wenn du sagst, I, you can choose only three moves, which would be... Okay, los. Was? Wie fängst du mal an? Also, if I would ask myself, Daniel, if you would choose three most important salsa moves, which one would you choose? War das jetzt okay, oder was habe ich jetzt gerade gesagt? Ich habe nicht so, ja. Ich komme jetzt mal ein. Daniel, <lacht> if you... Warum sagst du nie irgendwas? Three most important salsa moves. Daniel, if you would ask yourself. Daniel. <laughs> 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 Daniel, <laughs> ask yourself. Daniel. Daniel. Okay, I If I would ask myself, Daniel, what are the three most important salsa moves I need to choose from? That's what we're gonna show you now. That's what we're gonna show <laughs> you today. Check this out. Let's go.